Hello everyone, welcome to a fix video. Today I am going to be showing you how to connect your controller to uh, your PC to play FIFA 20. Now, uh, if you don't know already that you just uh, cannot play controller, uh, you can't play with your controller on PC on FIFA 20. But I have found a fix that worked for me. Very easy, if you follow all the steps, um, it will work for you. So first of all, you need to download DS4 Windows um, on your PC. You want to click download now. Um, obviously, I've already got it on my PC. Um, but um, obviously, you'll download it. You'll just follow all the steps. There'll be someone that's uploaded a YouTube video on how to download DS4 Windows, if you don't know it already. But you just want to download DS4 Windows. I'm going to show you what happens normally when you connect your controller to uh, FIFA 20. So you want to get your USB cable, plug it into your PC. Um, plug it into your controller. Uh, sorry, you're going to have to just put the camera down. I only have two arms. Very annoying. <laughs> there we are. So just connect, uh, connect your controller through a, a USB cable on DS4 Windows. It should light up uh, on your DS4 and also on your controller. Minimize DS4 Windows, then open up FIFA 20, and then just click play. This is the demo version, but this will, will work for the full version as well. Um, so, you you uh, normally, other people have said disk, uh, uh, not to connect your controller until after you've launched FIFA 20. This time, you want to connect whilst you're launching uh, FIFA 20. But I'm just showing you what works. This won't work. Um, I'm just showing you uh, this, uh, what normally happens, just to show you that it does fix my uh, problem and your problem as well. So this is what normally happens um, when you launch into FIFA 20. Just skip past all this. This will work fine for you, but it's once you have got into the actual game, it starts going all weird. Right, here we are. Nothing is working. Absolutely nothing is working. I'm going up. Just It's very delayed. It's skipping out two things. It's gone on to customize. It's just going all over the place. I said go right to go to new features, but instead it decides to go to home. The thing's glitching out at the top here, and just nothing works. Okay, so look at that. I'm not even touching it, and it's scrolling up by itself. All right, so that is what happens. So you want to make sure that you've closed your FIFA 20. Close your FIFA 20 on your PC. And then what you want to do now is you want to open DS4 Windows. And then click on stop, keep it open, and just minimize it. Okay? Now you've still got your USB cable connected to your PC. Disconnect it. And then disconnect it. You've just got an ordinary controller here. Now you want to go over to your Bluetooth settings. And then you want to... Oh, I've already done this before, so I'm just going to disconnect this controller very quickly. Um... So it, um, so I can show you what happens. All right, there we go. Right, you want to turn Bluetooth on on your PC, and you want to click on your PS4 and your share button. Um, hang on, we still have DS4 Windows open, don't we? Yeah. Uh, close your DS4 Windows. Okay. Then hold the PS4 button and then the share button together. Um. I cannot do this one-handed. Uh, PS4 and the share. Hold that for about f five seconds. And then, uh, sorry about this, I'm gonna have to just put the camera down, I can't uh, do two things at once. Um, so yeah, you hold the PS4 uh, and the share button together for a couple of seconds, and then it should start to blink. Hopefully you see that it's very sunny outside. So I'll just leave the controller there so you can uh, just see it's blinking there. Right, very good. 
Now you want to click on add Bluetooth or other device. You should see three options. Uh, you want to click on this, the top option, the Bluetooth, mice, keyboards, pens and audio. Not the controller one. It's very weird. But you want to click on that and then a wireless controller pops up. Then you've connected your controller and you've got no wires but it's lit up white your controller you want to just click on done to that you can close that you've connected your controller to your bluetooth now you want to launch up ds4 windows watch the controller it lights up dark blue then and it pops up connected to bluetooth with ds4 windows without using your usb cable no wires You've got this is Bluetooth and DS4 Windows working together. This is the best thing you're ever going to see. Then you want to open up FIFA 20. I, sorry about that, everybody. I accidentally clicked on my video. You want to open up FIFA 20. Still your DS4 Windows open and running with your PS4 controller or so connected to your PC's Bluetooth. You wanna let FIFA 20 load up. Sorry about the wait. We all know how long FIFA 20 takes to load. Um, so yeah, this 100% worked for me. I'm 99.9% .9 this is gonna work for you. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel for more fixed videos in the future. Then obviously you can select it. Obviously this is what I did before, but I'm gonna show you what it's like in the home screen and what it's like for kickoff and everything. So yeah, if you followed all of my steps, uh, then this should work for you. Here we are. Connected controller, no wires. Oh, I have to press select again. Oh gosh, more selecting. Um, da, 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 da. This is the problem about the demo. All right, here we go. Here we are. It completely works. Sometimes the music doesn't come on as well, but the music's fixed as well. We'll go on to kick off. I accidentally clicked on my home screen. Right, yeah, it works. You wanna select to kick off. It will pop up there are still two controllers connected because obviously you've got the Bluetooth con uh, controller and the DS4 controller. But the DS4 controller won't connect unless you've got a USB cable. So it, there's no two controllers fighting with one another. It's just one controller. You still need DS4 windows to make the Bluetooth on the controller stronger. And it all works. You can select your teams and everything. Hopefully it worked for you. Smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next video.